Do you know who I am? What's my name? Who then? That's right! Oh my god! <laughs> Sir, what's your name? I'm Robert Scoble. And Robert Scoble, where are we right now? We're at the Web 2.0 Expo in Moscone in San Francisco. And what is the Web 2.0 Expo all about? It's a bunch of dorks running around learning about web stuff. Does it bother you when people call you a big geek? Uh, no. I, actually, I, I call myself a big geek on the internet. I, I'm Robert Scoble, and if you search Google for uh, geek blogger, you'll probably find my blog. Now, is it true that you're the most powerful blogger in this uh, entire convention? I doubt it. Mike, Don't say that, John. Mike Errington is here. <laughs> He's probably more, more powerful than I am in this crowd. Are you number two? Yeah. Is it true that you used to work for Microsoft? Yeah, I used to work for Microsoft, and I became one of their more popular bloggers. So. How did you become so popular, Robert? I uh, wrote every night until 2 in the morning when nobody else was online. Is it true that you leak something? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? I, tr I tried to leak a lot, <laughs> but I'm not going to cop to it. <laughs> oh, you're not? No. Robert, what do you want to do with your life? Oh, man. Interview Steve Jobs. That's actually one of my dreams. Is he your hero? No. <laughs> He's my son's hero. Give us your thoughts on Steve Jobs. Um, He's... Uh, Arrogant dictatorship, but uh, understands the market better than anybody and understands how to sell you on stuff. Too smart are Bill Gates or Steve Jobs? Uh, I'd say Bill. Um, Bill is uh, more inquisitive, uh, has built a bit much bigger organization, um, has seen stuff that Steve hasn't seen. You know, Steve is, is damn smart. I mean, he, you know, he brought us the iPod, right? <laughs> how many uh, hits does your uh, blog get a day? Um, generally about 20 to 40,000, maybe as high as 80, depending on what sites are linking to it. Robert, are you familiar with Justin.tv? Oh yeah, I just met him here in the hall. So, so I'm looking at the camera on the top of your head. Do you want to be Justin.tv? No, because <laughs> I'm not going to wear this thing 24 hours a day like he is. <laughs> then how come you're blatantly copying him? Because I thought it was fun. <laughs> Robert, how often do you work out? Not very much. <laughs> Can't you tell? I'm, yeah, I can. What's the best undiscovered website out there? Oh, jeez. Mine. <laughs> What's your website again? Scobalizer.com. How do you spell that? S-C-O-B as in boy, L-E-I-Z-E-R. Okay. Or just go to Google and type Robert. <laughs> No, really. What's the best undiscovered website out there? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Who's the hottest chick on the internet? Veronica Belmont. Who's that? She's on CNET. <laughs> What's so great about her? She's hot. <laughs> and she's a geek. <laughs> Have you ever touched yourself looking at Veronica? No comment. That's a yes. <laughs> What's the best uh, movie you've seen in the past couple of years? Uh, the one that comes to mind immediately is 300 because that's the last one I saw. But How do you feel about the way they portrayed the Persians? My wife's Persians. <laughs> so am I, mother effa. <laughs> Robert, what's your biggest pet peeve? Assholes. <laughs> am I an asshole? No. <laughs> You're just annoying. <laughs> Robert, if I, have a, uh, if I have a really killer website up, are you going to promote the hell out of it for me? If it truly is really killer, absolutely. What if I put this interview up? I'll, I'll probably link to it. <laughs> say, I'll probably link to it. <laughs> see, uh, see what kind of schmuck I look like. You know? Well, not only that, and you're not just a schmuck. You're, uh, you're, people are you, they're going to see a side of you that they wouldn't normally see. Has anybody ever given you an interview this good? What's your website again? Scobalizer. Scobalizer.com. Everyone check it out. His name is Robert. Thanks for your time. Number one Robert on Google, actually. Of course he is. <laughs> That's easier to remember than Scobalizer.